Spider-Man. This is the life. No stoplights, no traffic jams, no trouble. Uh-oh, speaking of trouble. That sounded like someone breaking into the museum. A definite no-no if I ever heard one. Might as well get some photos for the bugle while old Spidey does his thing. mechanical arms of Dr. Octopus could have stolen this million-dollar ruby. And only the wiggly webbing of Spider-Man is gonna make you wish you never tried. You! Hey, that's a crummy way to say hello. You can stop worrying, Blue Eyes. Here's Spidey. to do to get rid of you. For starters, you could try eating onions. That does it. I'm quitting your fan club. Now that the web spinner's out of the way, I can continue with my master plan to take over the world. Sheesh. If I only had sinus trouble. I don't get it. Why would Octopus have stolen that ruby and left all the other jewels behind? Oh no, I forgot my homework. The professor will skin me for this. <sighs> no use. Doc Ock wore me out. I can't even keep my eyes. Poor Peter. I hope he didn't stay up all night doing his homework again. Peter, time to get up, dear. Oh, no. If Aunt May catches me in my spidey threads, I'm finished. I must have overslept. Well, you mustn't be late for school, dear. Remember, the early bird catches the worm. Uh, speaking of worms, anything on the radio about Doc Ock? Who, dear? Oh, look at that. Why, I just love those adorable red socks. Uh, yeah, I guess I was uh, in the mood for something funky. Well, don't forget to brush your teeth, dear, and wash behind your ears. Sure, sure. Uh, thanks for reminding me. Oh, Aunt May, don't ever do that to me. I've got to finish this history assignment on the landmarks of New York or I'll flunk for sure. And the only way for Peter Parker to reach the library in time is to go as our friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Hmm, 
now to steal the second object that I'll need for my master plan. <laughs> Boy, I'd better move it. Only two hours left to finish my assignment. Ooh, the old spidey sense is tingling. Well, there goes my homework. Spider-Man, what do you want? You try anything and I'll call campus security. Forget security? This looks like a case for Roto-Rooter. Spider-Man! You've got to help us. It's trying to steal our priceless moon rock. Oh, ho. now that you need me, I become Mr. Wonderful, huh? There. Maybe that'll hold him. Hey, cut it out. Let go. Let go. Boy, I got to be more careful of what I say. OK, Doc, if that's the way you want to do it. I blew it this time. Hawk outsmarted me. He's got his metal arms on remote control. Seems he's gotten away, Spider-Man. Fortunately, he left this valuable moon rock and took a worthless piece of quartz by mistake. Forget it, lady. Dr. Octopus doesn't make mistakes. That piece of quartz meant more to him than the priceless moon rock. And it's up to me to figure out why. Let's see, uh... Landmarks of New York City. Ah, here they are. Hello. Oh, how are you, Mr. Jameson? Oh, fine, fine, fine. Never better. Let me speak to Peter. I'm sorry, Mr. Jameson. Peter's studying. Could I? Studying? What do you mean, studying? The diamond exchange was just robbed. I need him to cover it. Well, you'll just have to get someone else, Mr. Jameson. Peter must finish his homework. Thank you for calling. You're so welcome. What was that, Aunt May? Oh, nothing, Peter. Just Mr. Jameson and something about a robbery at the Diamond Exchange. Hmm. Must be big stuff for the man himself to call. If Doc Ock's behind the robbery, only Spidey can stop him. Strange, powerful tentacle grabbed the diamonds and, and, and disappeared into the air vent. It's Doc Ock, all right. But I don't get it. Stealing little bits of jewelry isn't his style. I've got to learn what he's really after. My tentacles are now ten times as powerful as they were before. At last, I'm ready to put my most daring plan into action. Now to home in on Doc Ock. Look! It's Spider-Man! What's happening? He's going into the oh! sewer! Hey, Spidey! Sorry, folks. Uh, no time for autographs. Uh, but you may applaud if you wish. Yuck! Yeah. No wonder no one's ever found his hideout. He can have it. Ooh, my spider sense is ringing like a fire alarm. So this is where I'll web my camera. That's funny. There's no one here. But my spider sense has never been wrong before. And it's not wrong now, Spider-Man. Hey, it's nice of you to greet me with open arms, Doc. This'll be the last greeting you ever get, Web Swinger. You have any last words? Mm -hmm. If it's all the same to you, I'd like to start with... Help! I've had enough of your jokes, Spider-Man! You sure? Did I ever tell you the one about the... Hey! You could have waited till I got to the punchline. Well, a little web shot'll fix you. 
Oh, great. It's clogged with water. A pity, Spider-Man. But my deadly tentacles are waterproof. And this sonic quartz vibrator will paralyze you. Oh, I can hardly move. How lucky you are. You'll be the first to see how my new tentacles work, like this diamond saw. Thanks for the free show. When's the commercial? Sorry, web spinner. The show has ended for you forever. <laughs> Ixley on the bath, Doc. I never take one without my rubber ducky. <laughs> if I can't break these bars, it'll be bye-bye Spidey. I can't even budge him. If I don't break loose, it's the end of Spider-Man. And even worse, I won't get my homework done. Time to raise the periscope and find my first helpless target. There it is, a super tanker filled with millions of barrels of oil. Now for the final phase of my master plan. First, my laser tentacle will stop the ship. We've lost power! Excellent. Now to immobilize the crew. It's no use. We'd better call the Coast Guard. Oh, that noise! Oh, oh. My diamond drill will cut through this tanker as if it were butter. Now all I have to do is pump the oil into my secret tanks. Soon I'll control all the world's oil. And with it, I'll control the world! Boy, I never thought I'd envy a goldfish. Hey, there's what I need. A bottle of acid. But how do I reach it? A spider line is my only chance. Don't fail me now, you little squirter. Got it. This has to work. There isn't time for a second try. <gasps> I'll never take a bath again. Uh-oh. Hope the water didn't spoil my snaps. Well, can't worry about it now. Not while that six-armed nutcase is still on the loose. Why isn't that no good Parker around when I need all the photographers I can get? All of New York's oil is being drained away under our noses, and he's doing homework. Uncle Jonah, who needs that pipsqueak Parker anyway? I'll get you all the photos you need. Hey. Oh, <laughs> good idea, Mortimer. Take the Bugle's helicopter. Right. And Miss Brant, try to get hold of Parker again. And if his aunt answers, say it's a wrong number. Strange. There's no sign of Doc Ock anywhere. Extra, extra, read all about the mystery of the vanishing oil. Hey, can I believe my little shell-like ears? Get your daily Bugle here. According to reports from the U.S. Coast Guard, super tankers are being mysteriously drained of all their oil. I should have guessed. That's what Akka's up to. Uh-oh, there goes my beeper. Must be Aunt May. What's happening, Aunt May? Peter, wherever did you run off to? Uh, I had some more research to do. Well, I hope you're not studying too hard, dear. I don't want you to exhaust yourself. Uh, no, I'm uh, taking it real easy, Aunt May. But not too easy, Peter. We still want you to get an A on your homework. Oh, boy, what a mess. Not a trace of Doc Ock. And at this rate, I'll never get my homework done either. How will I face Aunt May? Hey, wait a minute. Why didn't I think of this before? If I can rewire my radio to the frequency of Doc Ock's sonic oscillator, I may be able to home in on him. It's working. 
Okay, Doc. Ready or not, here I come. There's no sign of trouble anywhere. I've got to get some photos and show off that flaky Peter Parker. Hey, what's that? It's Spider-Man! Quick, follow that no-good web-slinger. These tankers have no defense against my super-powered tentacles. Hmm, everything looks okay from here. I'll just set up my camera and check down below. Phew, that guy's got more tricks up his tentacles than a magician. Well, old Spidey knows a trick or two himself. The oil flow, it stopped. Something must have jammed. I'd better check the surface. Spider-Man! I'll take care of that meddling wall crawler once and for all! Hi, neighbor. Greetings from your welcome wagon. Forget it, fool. Nothing can penetrate this atomic glass I created. Why am I tackling the most dangerous crook on Earth again? I ought to have my pointy head examined. Hey, look, it's Dr. Octopus. And he's really singing it to Spider-Man. Hey, Ock, you keep this up and it'll be the end of a beautiful friendship. Whoa, any lower, I'd never need another haircut. Hey, now you've gone too far. Great! Spider-Man just got nailed! And for once, I'm scooping Peter Parker. Uncle Jonah will jump for joy when he sees the photos I took. Someone's spying on me from that helicopter. This will stop them. Dr. Octopus! He spotted us! Let's get out of here! Oh, no! He's got us! Hmm, looks like I'm about to become shark bait. Stop struggling or I'll put soap flakes in your fishbowl. Oh, no! The docks got Mortimer trapped in the Bugle helicopter. Almost hate to break it up. Those two deserve each other. I'll teach those fools to snoop on Dr. Octopus. Slipped his grip. Let's get back to the Daily Bugle. <sighs> wow, just what I've been waiting for. All I have to do is trick Doc Ock into going there. Yeah, that's all. Surely that web headed weasel doesn't think he can escape me so easily. You've run out of tricks, Web Slinger! This is the payoff! You can say that again, Doc! What's the matter, Blue Eyes? Cat got your tongue? This is Captain Gerard of the United States Navy. We'll take it from here, Spider-Man. Uncle Jonah? Hey, Uncle Jonah! What is it? Can't you see him? Oh, Mortimer, it's you. I got great news! I just took some pictures of Spider-Man getting finished off by Dr. Octopus. Spider-Man finished? Well, don't just stand there. Let me see him. Haven't even seen him myself, Uncle Jonah. Just got him from the lab. What? What? These pictures? 
pictures are totally blank. He... Is this some sort of joke, Mortimer? Oh, no. That laser blast must have ruined them. I swear they were incredible, Uncle Jonah. Dr. Octopus sent Spider-Man to the bottom of the harbor. Funny. That's not the way I saw it. It was Spider-Man who clobbered poor Doc Ock. Uh, hey, see, these... These are pretty good, Parker. If you didn't waste so much time doing homework, they'd probably be a lot better. Oh, no, my homework assignment. It's due in 10 minutes. I'm gonna fail for sure. Well, well you can't win them all, my boy. The important thing is, we got these great shots of Spider-Man web-swinging all over New York. All over New York. That's it. See you later, JJ. Wait, where are you going with my photos? Parker! Why, Peter, you got an A in your history class. That must have been a really excellent report you wrote. Well, uh, I didn't exactly write a report, Aunt May. Instead, I used the pictures I took for the Daily Bugle to make a photo essay on the landmarks of New York City. The prof loved it. Why, they're lovely, Peter. But they would have been perfect if that horrible Spider-Man hadn't been there to ruin every one of them. 